everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Amanda, and hopefully you clicked on this video because you wanted to see this bomb makeup look right here. This is my holiday makeup look with some DIY glitter eyeliner. In this video, I'm partnering with Glam Glow to show you guys the new Glam Glow glitter mask. There will be a skincare portion of this video to show you guys the mask and how it works, and then we're gonna move on to this makeup look. So if you guys are interested in seeing some skincare and some super cute holiday glitter makeup, then keep on watching. I have been wearing tons of makeup over this holiday season, like Thanksgiving, going out, weddings, all that stuff. So I really wanna detoxify my skin before I get started so I just have a clean slate for my holiday look. For my mask, I'm going to be using the new Glam Glow Glitter Mask. I'm sure you guys have seen this all over, so I'm really excited to give it a try and show you guys how it works for my skin. I have almost all of the Glam Glow masks, and this one is said to work just as well as the Gravity Mud Mask, which is one of my personal favorites. So let's try out this glitter mask and see how it works. So to start applying this mask, I'm gonna take a little bit on my Glam Glow brush that came in this little set and I'm going to start by applying this mask upwards onto my face and creating kind of like a thick layer so I'm able to peel it off really easily. The more of this mask you apply, the longer it's going to take to dry but it will be easier to peel off. This mask is a firming and contouring mask so once I peel it off my skin should be noticeably tighter and more youthful looking. This mask has the Tea Toxy Complex like much of their other masks and it has a touch of a licorice and marshmallow leaf so this is really going to help to detoxify and lift and firm my skin so I'm really excited to see the results. So this may just be the coolest and most beautiful mask I have ever put on my face. This is so cool. I am loving the feeling that this mask is giving me. It's very cooling, it has a cooling sensation. It feels like it's really working into my pores, which is so interesting because it's covered in glitter. I already love like the whole collection of Glam Glow masks, but this one is pretty amazing. I have never seen anything like this. So. I'm pretty impressed. I avoided my hairline, my eyebrows, and my under eye like you should with any peel off mask. And I've been waiting for about 30 minutes, so I think it's time to go ahead and peel this mask off. No joke, my skin feels absolutely amazing and it looks so clean. I wish you guys could see up close. I can tell the difference because I knew how clogged my pores were and how dull my skin was. But I don't know if you guys can tell how much brighter my skin is. So now that we got our skincare out of the way, I just put some moisturizer on to get ready for my full face of holiday makeup. So I went ahead and did one of my eyes already, so we're gonna get started on the other one. So for this look, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. And we're gonna be starting off with this shade right here. This is called Cayenne. So I'm just taking this shade and putting it in my crease and a little bit above my crease under my brow bone. So now that I'm happy with this color in my crease, I'm gonna go ahead and cut out my crease with some concealer. This is a lot easier than it seems. So if you've never done it, I would recommend giving it a try because it really adds another dimension to your eye looks. And I think it's really cool just to add a little pop in there and a little more accent. You don't have to go up this high. I just like to do that so it makes it look like I have a wider lid and I can do more with my shadows. But if you're a beginner and you wanna try it, you can always try like cutting out your actual eyelid. You can try to go up a little more. If you make a mistake, you can always go back in with some concealer. While that's still a little bit wet, I'm gonna go in with this color right here. This is called Chaser. And to deepen up the crease, I'm gonna be using this color right here. This is called Ashes. To make the shape of this green glitter wing, I'm gonna start by using a liquid eyeliner just to make it a little bit 
easier to see where my glitter is going to go. So I'm gonna be using the L'Oreal Infallible Paints Liquid Eyeliner in the color Wild Green. Now for the most fun part of this look. Oh my gosh. I don't know when I became so obsessed with glitter, but I just love glitter. So what I'm gonna be using for this is the new NYX Glitter Goals Glitter Kit. So we're gonna be using the shade Emerald. I'm just going to dip this brush into the primer and apply this first. I'm going to go ahead and take the same brush and dip it in the glitter and then apply it over that wing shape. For the bottom lashes, I'm going to add some shadow. I'm gonna use that, the Cayenne and the Ashes shade on the bottom lash line and then add some mascara and some lashes. To finish off the whole look, I'm going to be using the MAC Japanese Maple Cream Sheen lipstick which i love so i wanted to use something more of a pink and kind of neutral to really focus on the eyes so guys this concludes the holiday makeup look i hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed the skincare portion at the beginning with the glam glow glitter mask if you guys try this look definitely let me know tag me slide in my dms i want to see your holiday glitter eyeliner don't forget to like and subscribe and thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next one.